It's been that the the demand for rice is increasing, not only because of population, but because of uh, well uh, change in the preference. So it's mean that the produce the, the producer of this rice is limited. Food is really depending on the region, on the country. Mm -hmm. So the producer also is really depending depending on the nature of that uh, of that uh, community. Food becoming important not only for feeding people but also this kind of thing relationship. Uh, I I I come to the conclusion something like that. When we look at the farmer in Indonesia, they don't have a large scale land. They only have maybe at the most uh, only 0.2 hectares or 0.5 hectares. People they also like to eat tempe tahu, but we have imported tempe tahu, uh, the soybean from America. So <laughs> but then right now, uh, there is a shortage of this uh, stock of uh, soybean from America because China also shortage of this uh, of this uh, soybean. Mm. Uh, China they need for feeding f uh, pig, but for us this is for feeding people because we eat many tempeh and tahu. So this kind of thing is becoming uh, a trading. You see, uh, at, at at the end this becoming really the need of each country to feeding their people. Uh, we are open to the international collaboration, but then we also want to have a fair uh, collaboration. Uh, we, already, or we already have a cooperation with uh, many international, especially so far uh, only for uh, rice. But then uh, we are thinking uh, for horticulture, but then we are still in negotiation right now with the friends especially.